Can you forgive if you haven't been forgiven? This Advent, we're telling stories of either women who wrote Christmas carols or Christmas carols about women. And this week's song on the second week of Advent, as we're focusing on peace, is the so-called Coventry Carol. It reminds us that, that the light of Jesus's birth overcomes the darkness of human evil. This carol is actually around 700 years old. It was sung as part of a play that told God's story. Matthew chapter 2, verse 16 tells how after Jesus was born, Herod sent soldiers to kill all the boys in and around Bethlehem up to age two. The carol is haunted by words of women rocking their babies to sleep for fear that Herod's soldiers will hear the babes crying and slaughter them. Being Forgiven to be able to forgive is what made this song famous in our era. On November 14th, 1940, Hitler oversaw the bombing of Coventry Cathedral. Just six weeks later, on Christmas Day, the British Broadcasting Company aired a speech where the cathedral's leader, a person who had himself received Jesus' forgiveness, spoke as to forgive his enemies. And then, standing amid the rubble and the ruins, the choir sang this carol, this Coventry carol, this somber carol of women lullabying their doomed babies to sleep. And while one baby, Jesus, shone beneath the light of a star in the Bible narrative, untold numbers of babies suffered the darkness of death. Yet darkness did not win. God protected that savior baby and Jesus grew and lived and died for our forgiveness, light overcoming darkness, and that forgiveness allowing us to forgive others. As one historian said, the theme of redemption following suffering is what makes the Coventry Carol so special. It strikes a chord with us by pointing to both the shadowy side of humanity and the shining side that Christmas makes possible. John chapter one says, the word brought light to everyone. The light shines in the darkness and the darkness can never extinguish it. And to this day, this song of women protecting their babies, the song that Jesus the forgiver has enabled people to use to forgive is sung in Coventry Cathedral in England, which is now rebuilt every Christmas day. <laughs>